when it says to lift up our hearts with our hands unto God in where? The heavens. I know people see that as symbolic and okay, I need I just need to be focused on God in the he- in the heavenly realm. I need to do things in God's way. I need to orchestrate myself in the way God wants me to. Of course, yes, he does. Yes, he does mean that. Yeah, he does. But God took it in a deep layer I've never seen before. What God revealed to me is that to lift up your heart and with your hands is to lift your desires, your wants, and whatever you seek after, right? You're lifting up your desires, you're lifting up your wants, and whatever you seek after. Yeah, and, and in lifting up your hands, you're lifting up your actions and what you can affect. When you're lifting up your hands, you're lifting up your actions and what you can affect. Remember, you're a catalyst. Now, what God was revealing to me is that our hearts have to be lifted up first. Our desires, our wants, what we seek after have to be lifted up first. So that much defilement, corruption and chaff can be removed. This is why God is about heart service first. This stuff has to be removed because once the heart is removed of this, like defilement and um, evil, corruption, wrong ways of walking, then your hands change, your actions and the things you affect change once this changes. We know this, right? I'm still getting there, stay with me. I then see a vision. I see someone lifting up their heart to God above them. I see them just lift up their heart to the sky. Just as far as their hands can take it, they just shoot their heart up, right? And they're holding their heart up there. I see this person lifting up their heart above their head to God. And as I'm looking at the heart, I see black spots in them. I see where there is things that need to be removed. Right? I see, I then see God wave his hand. I see God wave his hand over the heart. And that's even symbolic too, that it requires the actions of God to deliver your heart. It requires the actions of God to clean your heart. But I see his hand wave over the heart to cleanse it. He did one wave and the whole heart was cleansed, like, like that quick, very, very quick. The hands I see that the person had after the heart was cleansed, I see them washed clean. And it's like I see water dripping off their hands because their hands are washed clean. Their actions, the things they they can affect. I heard after seeing this vision, heart washing. God is doing a heart washing. Even now, I can tell God is showing me that people are people are having their heart washed clean even now. Through revelation, right? Through revelation, truth, your heart is washed and clean. That's why in the beginning of this study, I told people, make sure your heart is vulnerable to God in this study. Make sure your heart is vulnerable to God in this study okay now more revelations coming it's not done yet there's more what god was revealing to me and this is powerful and i pray everybody gets it lifting up your heart is one thing to the heavens right because now your heart is where in heavenly places stay with me Our hands raised to God in the heavens means our hands are in the kingdom of God. Now, when your hands are in the kingdom of God to raise above your head, what you got to do, pull things down. When your hand is up above your head, you must pull things down. Here it comes, y'all. Y'all about to get it. It's about to be an explosion revelation right here. When God says, raise up your heart and your hands to heaven, God is stating that the kingdom of God is taking hold of it and pulling down the kingdom of God. 
we're supposed to be pulling down the kingdom of God as it so is in the heaven of God where he resides so shall it be on earth but who's pulling it down who's pulling down the kingdom and saying come here I'm pulling down this kingdom and releasing it because you're a carrier of it you have a cause greater than what you can state this is why you can never base your cause on this planet off of you because God says, no, your cause is this. You're supposed to be pulling down the kingdom of heaven down. You're supposed to be pulling my kingdom down here. You're supposed to be pulling it down. So you're supposed to raise your heart up to God, to the heaven where he resides, where he can wash you clean because this world and the carnal mind and the ways of this world, keeping your heart here on this world is total defilement. Remember, this world is like a sea with told is full of murky water. Why would you keep your heart here in murky water? No, you have to let your heart raise to heaven so that God can wave his hand clean over it. Clean your heart, raise your hands to heaven so that you can pull it down and produce it here. Understand what the scripture is saying. Pull down heaven, raise your hands up to heaven and pull it down and release it. You are a catalyst. This is why God was showing me your heart is your desires, your actions, and your wants. Your hand is your action and what you can affect. What can you affect when you pull the kingdom down? 